Welcome to the presentation of the Mechanical Drive Training System. I'm Sebastian De Silva, and I'm speaking with Mr. Florian Hillian, the contact person for this product at Festo France. Hello. You probably have several questions regarding the Mechanical Drive's system. We'll do our best to answer them all. Before we proceed, would you please explain the background of the Mechanical Drive system? Of course. When we started thinking about the design of the system, we discussed our ideas with the instructors and identified key aspects to consider. Work, space, time, available for training, and obviously safety. We observed that learning equipment is sometimes a bit outdated. As a result, student safety cannot be entirely guaranteed. And, most importantly, instructors generally can't teach a lot of different subjects because this would require several different machines which would occupy a lot of workshop space. We thought it was time to bring something new to the field to improve the training experience for both instructors and students. This is where the mechanical drive system comes into play. All industrial mechanics fundamentals can be taught on a single workstation. While instructors are very creative in finding ways to transfer fundamental technical skills to students, they are often confronted with the problems I just mentioned. This training system is a great solution. What are the main educational objectives achieved by the system? First, students learn the basic theoretical concepts using the workbooks, then move to hands-on learning. They work autonomously in a safe environment. Instructors come in to validate the work and to start the machine. The system provides students with real-world preparation for the tasks that they will have to perform in their future workplace. We're talking about gears, shafts, chains, sprockets, and so on. These topics can then be complemented with supplementary equipment covering laser alignment as well as vibration metering and analysis. So, it is a complete system that encompasses all there is to know about mechanical drives. That's the objective, teach all of the fundamentals of industrial mechanics in a single learning system. And components, you're mentioning pulleys, belts, gears, is this educational equipment? Yes, it is, but it's industrial grade equipment, scaled to fit and to be used within the workstation. Most components have the same bore diameter, which multiplies the variety of possible mechanical drive setups from simple to more complex. The supporting curriculum adds up to 188 hours of training distributed among the different levels. It is targeted at technical colleges teaching programs such as industrial mechanics and machinery maintenance. It can also be used in a continuing education context. And how is the training curriculum structured? The program is divided into four individual modules, which except for modules 1 and 2 are independent. Why? Simply because Module 2 expands on specific concepts introduced in Module 1. Module 3 and 4 can be tackled separately. So, it's a fully modular and flexible system, a clear benefit for training purposes. Correct, and the greatest educational value is really in this modularity. First, students are familiarized with the workstation, basic components, accessories and safety concepts. Then they progress to Module 1, which encompasses belts, chains, and gears. If instructors want to take a deeper dive into these components, Module 2 can be added, which again is completely complementary to the first module. Then Module 3 covers shaft alignments, couplings, and bearings, as well as seals. Finally, Module 4 covers clutches, brakes, ball screws, and linear bearings. Have you gotten feedback regarding the system yet? Yes, I did have the opportunity to have students test drive the equipment. What came out of these sessions is that students are more comfortable working with a system scaled down to their needs. It allows for better learning. Many told me that often, when they must deal with a real motor, they don't quite know where to begin or how to approach it. Whereas with this system, components are easily visible and recognizable, which helps students learn more readily. This is the main feedback I received after presenting the system. The intent is to move the students forward step by step so that they question their work and understand and correct their mistakes. The system invites students to reflect on what they are doing rather than just blindly follow what is written in the instructions. If I understand this correctly, all aspects of hands-on training will be covered by the modules. Exactly. Students will have all of the necessary tools on hand to work directly on the mechanical drives workstation.
all the small parts, like screws and bolts, are organized, sorted, and conveniently stored. Mechanical components are stored on the labeled panels for easy identification and quick size differentiation. This is a much more efficient storage method than what we've seen in some schools, where the components, tools, screws, etc., are just tossed into one storage bin. And an incredible amount of time is wasted as students search for and identify the components they need. With the design and organization of our new mechanical drive system, students can quickly and easily find what they need and immediately get to work, saving precious lab time. Are there more storage options? And what are the advantages? As I mentioned earlier, all accessories are neatly stored and can be easily identified. A workbench will also be available to accommodate all of the equipment, the tabletop workstation will be put on top of the bench, and the drawers beneath will provide plenty of space to store all of the components, accessories, and tools for all the modules. The bench will also be equipped with casters so that it can be easily moved around and will even fit through standard door openings. It's truly a complete and mobile solution. What about the size of the system? Its compact size is an advantage. The workstation measures 70 by 150 centimeters, 27 by 59 inches, ensuring students have enough space to safely work without getting in each other's way. Thank you very much. I now invite you to watch the mechanical drive system in action. After starting the machine, several adjustments can be made, including motor speed variation. You can also tighten the brake to have an immediate impact on the setup. Regarding safety, in addition to the lockable safety cover and emergency button, sensors detect the opening of the cover and cut power if it is lifted during operation. Setups with chains can be assembled and are only part of the multiple possibilities offered by the system. A transparent cover allows for observation of setups and the effects of the powering of the brake. The control panel provides important information, particularly regarding energy consumption. The mechanical drive training system comes conveniently equipped with all the necessary tools and accessories to perform the exercises.